Hey guys, welcome back to HammerDrawers.net. I'm going to show you today some sort of uh, hidden features of ice cream sandwich. I wouldn't say, well, some of them are quite obvious, some of them are well publicised, others not so much. Some of them you could probably do before ice cream sandwich, but uh, there's no harm in me pointing things out now. Um, one thing I can't really show, well, unless anyone happens to call me uh, while I'm doing this, but when someone rings from a landline, it shows you the actual area that the area code relates to. It tells you the, the physical location. Obviously, it doesn't work on mobile phones because I don't really have area codes. Um, another one which I think was before Ice Cream Sandwich, but here we go. No. So if you press to change the volume, you can tap to rotate through, sort of vibrate and, and sound on. Um, the screenshot feature, most people will know, but I struggled to get it working at first. I didn't realize you have to hold them down. So I'm going to press them both. I hold them for a good second, and there it is. Screenshot saving. Screenshot captured, touch to view. If you happen to have more than one notification, swipe it away. Um, you can delete apps directly from your app drawer. So as I hold down on an icon, I get two options at the top there. Look, I can either have app info, where it tells you about the application, how much data it's using, etc., etc., or I could go straight to uninstall. I won't do it right now, I like that app, it's useful. Um, you can make folders in the bar along the bottom, again hopefully people have realised that, just simply drop more than one thing in there and it creates the folder for you which you name of course. Um, the browser is where we're going to head next. Now, one thing, it might be because I'm running uh, the Modico Custom ROM and I don't have it now, but it used to be I'd turn it sideways and it wouldn't rotate. If that's happening to you, actually it's a feature, you turn it sideways and it waits for you to tap the screen, tap the screen and it should rotate. Um, it did used to happen to me, obviously it's not now, and like I say, perhaps it's because I'm in this particular ROM. Then we're going to go into Settings, Labs, Quick Controls and Full Screen, I'm going to come back out. So now there's my web page taking up the whole screen, but well, how do I browse anywhere, Andy? I hear you asking. Tap on the side of the screen. These options come up. I get settings here. I get my tabs here. And as you saw it, uh, and I get the the URL line there. And again, if I don't want one of those, I'm sure you already know that one, swipe it away. So that's quite cool, quite handy. Um, also, if we hold down back, up comes my history and my bookmarks, etc. So there's a few uh, a few tips within, within the browser. Um, so then I'm going to go into Maps. So when in maps, I'm sure you already know, double tap zooms you in. Still loading there, there we go. Double tap zooms you in. Did you know double tap with two fingers? Actually, sorry, it's a single tap with two fingers, zooms you back out. Uh, also, in any, uh, in this case it's generally stock apps, but any ice cream uh, sandwich compatible, if you hold down on an icon it tells you what that icon is for. The next set of things are in the camera. If I go to video mode and I'm recording some really interesting video of this grey screen, there's my hand. Oh, double tap takes a photo. It's not a very interesting photo, but it is a photo. Um, the other thing with the camera app, the front facing camera can record 720p. Again, not very highly publicised, and I've got to be honest, I'm not really sure why you'd want to. Um, I guess maybe if you're recording yourself for some reason, but you know, some, many people seem to like it. Then we can uh, <coughs> shortcut into settings through the notification bar, 
and there's a couple of things we can show you in here as well. Developer options, we can basically force um, hardware acceleration in applications. Some of the uh, that increases the speed in some apps. Oops, I want to stay in there. Others, you might find it kind of breaks them. So uh, see how you go with that one. Might be might be useful, might not. The final thing, I would hope everybody's seen this by now. We're going to tap on Android version. There's our little Android ice cream sandwich fellow. I'm going to hold on him, and he's going to get bigger, and then he's going to fly around on the screen. So, there we go. Maybe uh, maybe you knew all of those. Maybe you didn't know any of them. Maybe a few. Hopefully uh, you've learned something. Obviously, if you know some of the great tips, stick them in the comments below. My name's Andy. How much have you done it?